It's standing room only inside a 787 flight deck as people try to get a glimpse of the state-of-the-art features and learn about procedures unique to the Dreamliner. So, so there's two ways to do it. You can use this. But this isn't a tour for fun. It's an hours-long orientation for the team at LAN Airlines, the first carrier in the Americas to offer the 787. We're very excited about this plane. It has a lot of features, new features that will enhance our safety, our crew uh, operation. It's late March at the Fadai Air Show in Santiago, Chile, months before LAN gets its first 787. But the Dreamliner on static display here offers a chance to get some early hands-on training. And early is key. Boeing and LAN actually began preparations two years ago because there's just so much to do before a new airplane type enters into service. The challenges are big. You have a air, air crew training, you have maintenance training. Uh. Getting the mechanics trained, getting the proper stock to support the parts requirements. We have to get the airline ready to uh, deal with the airplane. So on this night, long after everyone left the airshow grounds, class remains in session. Boeing engineers guide Land's flight operations team through important protocol. Meanwhile, flight attendants check out the long list of lighting options, one of the many features passengers will enjoy in the spacious cabin. Later, Boeing experts demonstrate maintenance software that helps mechanics instantly identify potential faults so they can get right to fixing an issue. Whatever our doubts are, whatever our needs are, Boeing is always there, and uh, I think it's going to be a very smooth entry into service. Boeing plans to continue this close working relationship with LAN from their first 787 all the way to their 32nd and beyond. Boeing engineers called field service representatives will be stationed at LAN's headquarters providing round-the-clock support, just as they do now on 767s and 777s. It's designed to give LAN a competitive edge in serving more passengers in the fast-growing Latin American region. We're putting all our efforts in, in this project. It's very important for LAN and so is for us.